Well, I've been attending the um, Sustainability Weeks for many years now, since uh, the first conference uh, 15 years ago. I've seen uh, the evolution and I've seen as well the good uh, uh, integrated approach that the Sustainability Weeks uh, do bring as they should. It's not about uh, narrowly focused approaches in dealing with uh, sustainability through a kind of uh, misleading reductionist approach. It's very much in a comprehensive way as we have seen it in the sessions or the speeches today. When we talk about climate, we need to link that to energy, to water, to food systems, and to resilient investment in, uh, in infrastructure. And uh, it has been bringing the uh, the experts um, uh, from research, from science, and from those who are taking decisions like policymakers, in addition to top uh, CEOs and investors. So it has a good mix as well when it comes to the, these gatherings, the, the needed science and data supporting decision-making at the government level and uh, with investments as well. Well, um, through the uh, good arrangements of, um, uh, of the work, mixing the good talk and the good arrangements and exhibitions we have been seeing to the actions, not just within the UAE, but beyond through um, uh, sustainable investments, green investments, and uh, discovering er um, early the importance and the comparative advantage and the future of uh, renewable energy. And it was really a kind of a surprise for a country that is very much uh, rich in the hydrocarbon sources of energy to go uh, beyond the short term, mid term, to think about uh, the future. And that was back when Mazdar was established and, uh, and back even in the early days, I would bring it back to 20 years, when the whole idea of having a diversified source um, um, uh, sources for energy. And I still remember very well in one of the main speeches by um, um, His Highness uh, Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed, who say that exporting the last barrel of oil will be a cause for celebration because we are going to be ready for it with the technology, with the diversified structure of, um, of the economy and the readiness of our society to, uh, uh, to join that celebration. Dr. Sultan had seen it all and had done it all um, uh, from different perspectives as uh, um, a states uh, man, as uh, a practitioner, as a leader in, in business and um, very good supporter as well of the advances in knowledge and research uh, and uh, willing, uh, the willingness to take uh, risk in uh, some of the advanced uh, areas um, of work. Uh, so in addition to what you'd expect from uh, some uh, steady conventional way of handling matters, where that could be expected and handled properly in that respect, it was always uh, ready as well to uh, take very careful and calculated risk and has been always great as well to work uh, in partnerships and to lead uh, teams to success. And um, we had seen these actions, especially the great uh, uh, endeavors and, and action had been undertaken with his excellent coordination under the leadership of uh, Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed and Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid.